All right, today, a simple discussion on this bad boy right here, Mexican Coca-Cola. Cue the intro. What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another video. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. So I might give this a try just for nostalgic sake. I reviewed this some time ago. Uh, this is a Mexican Coca-Cola. You can check it out right there, Refresco, and you see the standard uh, ingredients sticker that is usually found on these 12 ounce bottles of Mexican Coca-Cola. So like I said, I recently reviewed Mexican uh, Coca-Cola and I mentioned about the addition of cane sugar in the Mexican Coke, which makes it to me better than the majority of Coca-Colas in the United States. Now, I was inundated with people telling me, I don't know what I'm talking about. They don't use cane sugar anymore. They stopped that so long ago. Uh, there were so many of these comments that I'm like, I know I did my research. I know I looked it up. And actually on the label that shows what's in the product you are consuming, it said cane sugar. This one says cane sugar. You could see it right there in the ingredient list. I'll hold it up for a minute. But yes, this is a Mexican Coca-Cola exported to the United States, and it does have cane sugar. So here's the information I know about uh, Mexican Coca-Cola. So what I read back in 2013, a Mexican Coca-Cola bottling company announced that they would stop using uh, cane sugar for the high uh, fructose corn syrup. But there was a little caveat to that. They came out and said, and I quote, the change would not affect bottles specifically exported to the United States as Coca-Cola nostalgia products. So products that are exported to the United States from Mexico would still have cane sugar according to Mexican Coca-Cola. Yeah, I don't know. So are they uh, not telling us the truth? Because like I said, this has cane sugar in this uh, bottle right here. Uh, so there is a simmering trade war going on with Mexico and uh, the United States. And I think back in 1977, Mexico passed a uh, tariff on uh, high fructose corn syrup. Uh, they have this whole back and forth thing going. It is a uh, mess. Uh, but back to the matter at hand, uh, I did that video. And like I said, so many people adamant about it saying no. Mexican Coca-Cola does not have cane sugar. So I'm gonna show it to you one more time. I am opening up the comments and welcoming anybody to try and uh, tell me that cane sugar is not in Mexican Coca-Cola because I know the bottle I'm holding actually does say cane sugar on the uh, ingredients list. So let's just pop this open and uh, give it a taste. Not the best uh, bottle opener, but I got it. I got it out. Let's take a sip uh, as we end this little uh, discussion video. Like I said, leave some comments below. I did about uh, 30 minutes of research uh, looking at so many articles. I actually just saw a, um, I don't know, it was a special, like a documentary about one certain uh, city, and I'm forgetting what country it was in, that was addicted to the Coca-Cola. I forgot what was the quantity that they averaged drinking per day, but this one uh, town or city in this one country. If I can find it, I will uh, put it up here. Uh, but it was crazy, this uh, documentary about uh, Coca-Cola and cane sugar. But uh, let's take a sip. This usually is so good out of the bottle with cane sugar. Just saying, I see it with my own two eyes. Cane sugar, Mexican Coca-Cola. Yeah. There's something about it that's I don't want to say medicinal, uh, but the Mexican Coca-Cola has like a sharpness to it, uh, still great uh, carbonation and a nice uh, Coca-Cola flavor. But there's something about a Mexican Coca-Cola, uh, whether it's the addition of the bottle as well as the uh, cane sugar. Uh, I don't know, but uh, that's it. Quick little video. I was at the grocery store, saw this, and I said, oh, okay, I know I got a lot of backlash for this, saying, no, 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 they don't do it anymore. Uh, but according to a mashed.com article that I just saw, 2020, they say that the exported Coca-Cola from Mexico to the United States still contains cane sugar, and that's what I'm going with. So shout out mashed.com. Uh, I will link your article in the uh, description below so you guys can just check it out if you are uh, on the other side of the fence saying no, they don't use cane sugar anymore. So that's it. Thank you for joining me. 
Don't forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. Uh, that's social media, getting the word of my channel out to uh, some people. So, uh, all right, that's it. Wanted to just throw this out there, let the comments flow, and uh, that's it. We'll see you soon with some more reviews. Bye.